you know what? I'm just going to let this go. I'm going to let this one go because otherwise I won't be commenting the match. We'll just be complaining about this. Yeah. All right, so they're starting at Smashville. I, uh, oh, wow, what a shock. Three, they're starting at... Uh, one, All right, we got Goth Ness uh, and um, Black Knight Ike. So uh, neither of these costumes are good. That's savage. <laughs> I'm sorry. If a costume looks cool, it's bad. That, that's here, that's here my, today, folks. That, that, that's my position. That's my position. Uh, it's the whole try-hard thing. I don't know. Uh, characters who look cool shouldn't be good, and vice versa. Well, Mewtwo looks cool, guys. That's the problem. Oh, should be good. Characters that look like idiots should be good, and nobody else. I, I feel like there's some. That's what, do you want? Do you know why everyone loves Hungry Box? It's not because of the rest. It's because it's Jigglypuff. It doesn't matter how good Jigglypuff is, it's her presence. It's this, her presence. this is my position. Now, by extension, Ness should be better than Ike, or at least win the matchup, because Ness looks like less badass than Ike. You see, do you see what I'm getting at here? I get it. I, I mean, you don't have to agree, but you see my line of logic. I understand as it. As it. That doesn't is. mean I agree. Oh, yeah, no, no. I mean, oh. I'm, I'm exaggerating. Okay. Like, I'm a Roy player, you know? All right. Well, anyway, match. game. All right, so landing these heavy hits. Um, Ike up here is going to take that first stock from me. Uh, yeah, that up here is real nice. I've been thinking about picking up Ro Ike as a pocket. You know. Yeah, good. Like, he, he has some things that, that people really don't seem to like, watch out for. Yeah, like his uh, forward air nair out of full hop. Uh, there's also like, if you, do, if you do falling nair, you can get a grab off of it. Yowza, really? I'll have to keep that in mind. He does some pretty cool things. Like I, I gotta remember like what he does exactly. But he's a, he's a nifty guy. Yeah, no, he's cool. And he's I wonder like if we'll see his Marth upcoming uh, because uh, his Marth uh, wrecked me. Uh, anyway, uh, eggplants really evening this out. They're basically within margin of error, apart from you know relative weights. But relative weights don't mean anything when Ness has that back throw. I, I feel like there's some options that just weren't like done. But like besides that, I feel like the match being played. Like, oh yeah, yeah they're definitely warming up to each other. They're gonna I, right. with any luck, any. For, uh, for us viewers. They're going to get a lot more intense in the near future. Oh, that was nice. Just enough time to uh, put out another hitbox to catch his attempt when to he punish. did, like, jab-jab, he could have gone in for the grab. The eggplant was stuck in shield. And, if he, and, and, and even if he dropped shield, it's nine frames, I think, to drop... What is it, nine frames? It's seven. Seven frames to drop shield. He's going to get the grab anyway. But, you know, it's still really evenish. Why did he go for the count? Uh, because he was an end lag from the uh, eruption. Eruption has a lot of end lag. Right. Way more than like than flare blade or or, or even shield break. I'm just it's questioning why he's going for the eruption anyway when he can just do. Because if he hits the counter at the wrong time, he's in a bad place, and no, uh, EPMD gets through it anyway. Super armor up though, but that's not good. Yeah, no, no, th no. Th it's definitely it's definitely the right choice, even in this matchup, to use eruption. Because counter, if he's too close, then he gets the invincibility. And if he doesn't, it, it's it's very risky, especially for Ike, given his um recovery weirdness. I mean, if he had a hard read, or if uh, say uh, Eggplant had to go more horizontally, right? Then he def. But from below, right. it's not worth it. Well, it's, it's worth it. Depending it's how worth far, it. Maybe how far running away off they are. and back airing. Oh. But a counter, no, it's not worth it. There's better ways to get done. Yeah, I guess. Oh, PFGs, you know, oh, or a bark bark. There's a material. All right. PFG really just plays the roster, it seems. Apparently so. I, I've only known he has a Mario and like a Cloud. Or He's got a Marth. I never, I never played it, so I don't know. <laughs> I know it uh, kicked my butt, but if I got any more practice against it, I could probably handle it. Ooh. I mean, yeah. after all, Roy clearly wins that match. Co commentary shade on the down low. <laughs> all right, all right. So you got the Flood. You know, the, our little, uh, oh wow, that little run up jab. That was actually pretty impressive in terms of like timing and stuff, not instead of doing a dash attack. Down air to back, back air. air. Oh. oh, and top smash, but nope. No, no air dodge. Yeah, no air dodge. And already Ness has taken the up. lead because Ness, at low percents, Ness just. At low percents, Ness is always even. Yeah, I guess so. Can't really say he's not. Oh, that was an interesting mix-up. Using the uh, jump to make it a, to suggest a PK Thunder 2 or an aerial, and then just hitting him with the snake. Oh, that was a really hard game. read. You get punished for it, He should have been. Uh, PK fire into grab. Yeah. 
But the thing is, like, if you, if you punish with up smash, that thing's like practically unpunishable. Impun it's basically just resetting neutral. Yeah, but with more percent on Mario's pet half, which is never bad, especially because because you know Ness has a kill throw. Characters with kill throws benefit from resetting for neutral as long as they're game building percent. Oh, we get the spike. Ooh, I looked away. Yeah, I know. I don't think he DI'd that right at all. I'm pretty sure if he DI'd it right down, he might have been able to attack the stage. But he, he DI'd it out, I think. Yeah, cool. that happens. And that's why he like, went straight These out. Nairs, these Nairs. Who is he, Roy? These Nairs. Narrow plane. I like to call, uh, like call Nessa Nair the narrow plane. Because it looks like a little mini like, helicopter. Like he's, like he's doing a Sonic run. No, no, but, no, no like the Nair looks like a little helicopter. Yeah, but the helicopters aren't planes, they are. That's the best they could do. The Alright, these multi jabs. Oh, really trying hard to cover options with that, but just. That's mm. uh, and now it's even. <laughs> yep, yep, it's even. Just as quick as that. It's, I mean, it's literally even. Eggplant might actually technically be ahead. Technically, uh, now yeah, he is. Yeah, <laughs> as now I said, he is. Ne as soon as he took the stock, he was ahead. This is something right. you have to understand. He should have just gone for the grab, he got greedy. A little bit. But the punish wasn't that, you know, huge. Ooh, I Whoa! Watch it. Uh, Detail getting interrupted. I think that was a crouch canceling. Yeah, crouch canceling. Uh, people forget about it. It's, it's not as prevalent. It's right? only six. It only takes off one seventh of knockback it, instead of like half. No, no, it's one seventh. You're right. But uh, I mean, that's, that's if make you're a gonna difference. if you're gonna question whether I know the like the multiplier ratios of something in this game. If you're going to question that, reminder, I play a character who only does oh. anything because I know frame data. Can we just acknowledge that? That yeah. I'll beat a fireball? It's yeah. delicious. It's just like, you can stop now. <laughs> yeah, like, no, no, no. Mario is such a fun character to watch. Just because he's so... Oh, oh that's spacing! And that... Sexual tension. Oh, man. <laughs> and, oh, and now we're going into game three. That was some slick play. And just great spacing, a big charge oh, closes it out. Oh, I just realized if PFG wins this, he's got to fight Edwin again. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> I'm completely impartial in this. Yeah, Mostly same. I'm just mad that I didn't beat PFG. Eh, it happens. That's the game. He's charging his shield breaker on the ledge, right? And I run up and I counter it. And it misses. And so my counter doesn't go off. And he F smash tippers me. No. Which is insane. It's insane. It's insane. Well, that that I, I just I don't understand how it how that neutral B could miss and then the F smash. It was like a micrometer, the smallest possible. It was, it's like a phantom. It's like a melee phantom hit. That that's what it must have been. It must have phantom hit in my counter box because it was. We're going to temple. It, Do it. <laughs> uh, go to true great cave, real great cave. Oh my god. <laughs> real great cave hours. <laughs> now, there's an interesting thing about Great Cave, which is that characters slide different distances on the two halves of the stage. Grass has a traction effect. You also slide different lengths on the grassy parts of, uh, of Windy Hill compared to other things. Grass has a distinct traction, and a sliding up smash will cover less distance on grass. I have all this information instead of skill. We're a good character. We'll take that, though. Oh. oh wow! That that would that, that, would, that was basically. I'm amazed that he did. I guess he was just below the water edge, doing that, did, doing that, doing that fluid early, dynamics. I think he did it too early. That's why. What what it was is that the water doesn't affect the snake. It only affects Ness. The reason Flood beats it, and he the water just didn't hit Ness. I was saying he did it too early because if he did it, if he did it like right when Ness was like trying to come up with upbeat, he might have pushed it back. Maybe. Maybe. But I don't know. I I, I kind of trust. Ooh. And, then, and then at that point, he could probably just cape him. Mm. Oh, oh, that rolling. That was going to get tense. But I'm just going to take it. That, that little... Uh, that, that came off as like a oh. West, Western thing, right? Not some horrible dog. No. <laughs> it sounded like a Western thing. Aw, oh, man. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, trying to get that. Trying to get it. You know. Little... That was a snake. 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 I think it might be popping. Hold on. This is like, 
<laughs> the, the footsies in this matchup yeah, like are crazy. astonishing. <laughs> because Ness only needs to rack up like another 20% and then, then back throw will kill at the ledge. I'm sure back throw will kill at ledge like, like no. 10 uh, it depends on how much rage gets filed on first. Oh, oh, that was almost, uh, that was that almost was like zesty. <laughs> uh, PFG wanted to ride in style. Yo! We're living though. I would. I just would have sent out a um uh, a snake. Actually. What the edge garden? Yeah. Less we'll commitment. We'll really kill Less That's chance of. It's not about whether it kills, it's just racking up percent because the edge guard probably wasn't going to kill anyone. Anyway. Right, but it was a lot less. It would have been a lot lower risk. Like, oh, yeah. yeah. It would have been a lot the, lower the risk. The thing is, is that he was already at like. Um, Back 120. Yeah. I guess. It just would have been lower risk. I either don't edge guard him at all or use the snake, in my opinion. 